Mayong adlaw, magandang araw. Hello, what is up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. This is your Filipino boy, Lucas. Trying to stay on the budget. Today, I'm gonna repair some rusted areas of my 1999 Acura EL. I've picked up this um, Bondo fiberglass repair kit from 3M. I'm gonna unbox it and show to you guys the content of the kit. And also, I'm gonna show you the three steps of repairing some rusted areas, which is preparation, filling, and sanding. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button, guys, and support my channel. Stay tuned! So, as I told you, three steps. First is preparation. So, in order for you to prepare, wash the dishes first. So, your wife will not get mad at you. <laughs> Before you touch your car, do something on your car, prepare everything, make sure there's no choice, chores left behind. Hugas mode, para walay kasaba. Here in Canada, the parts and labor are very, very expensive. So if you're you're dreaming on having a project car, so you must learn how to do it on your own in order for you to save some labor money. So um, my job right now, I'm a mechanic apprentice. So what I've learned from the shop, I try to apply it. I'm into like um, old school cars, so that's that's also the the, the inspiration. That's why I, I got the 1999 Acura EL um, since it's 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 not a mainstream. It's no um, not everybody has it, but uh, it's a Honda Civic, so. That's why I choose to build the Acura EL. Yeah, so try to stay on the budget so your wife will not yell at you. <laughs> I'm not yet done on my preparation, guys. I have to prepare for dinner. So here I got a slab of meat. I'm gonna cook kawali and adobo. After that, I can proceed to my second step, which is filling. Filling the stomach. <laughs> so here's the unboxing of the Bondo fiberglass repair kit from 3M. So I'm gonna show you the inclusion of the kit. This is the resin here. It's 213 ml. <laughs> so dirty. <laughs> and this one is the hardener. So it says here 6 ml. The fiberglass cloth. On the description, it says um, 2,787 centimeters square, and the mixing stick, and the plastic spreader, and I guess this is the mixing tray. Eventually, the wife is already full, so I can touch my car now. I can do whatever I want. So I'm gonna show you the rusted areas of my 1999 Acura EL. So here it is guys. It's on the fender and here. Same also on the passenger side. I have a little bit of rust here on the hood. And here, starting to bubble. Oh no, starting to form rust. And over here, on the wheel well. And under here, the door. So 
So yeah. Um, stuff that you might need. So some white vinegar and some cloth and acetone, wire wheel and a drill driver. Now I'm gonna show you how to prep the area. Since I'm just using my phone guys, it's really hard to um, sand this out and take a video. So here it is. I removed some surface rust already using the wire wheel. might wanna sand this past the rust so you would know how how bad is the rust and just an inch so you would not have a big um, area to work with I'm gonna apply the vinegar to cure the surface rust so you can buy some rust reformer but since I'm showing you guys how to repair some rusted areas and save some money so you can use vinegar make sure to do it on the inside and um, let it uh, rest for like for overnight so you would see the effect okay so here's the area guys I let it soak with the vinegar overnight so as you can see here I think this one is ready to um, put the fiberglass here. So I have here my acetone. You can use this to clean some grease and wax on your paint. Um, you can buy some solutions, but yeah, so this. It's, it, this is just like one dollar so this is good for the budget build so I'm trying to um, stay on the budget and my wife can use this one too if she wanna <laughs> remove her nail polish so yep that's it my preparation is done here I can now put my um, fiberglass repair kit so just um, um, a trick I learned from YouTube so it would be easier if you get a marker and a piece of paper and um, use it here as a template so it would be easier for you to cut out the fiberglass cloth here's my template just mucking it up I'm gonna mix the resin and start putting in
so this is already hard um, you should sand it first before filling with a bondo glass see in mixing a bondo glass filler or any body filler um, just a trick so you should um, get a wax paper and piece of cardboard so in mixing a body filler um, just run across the hardener just like that and that will be enough so I already put the body filler, the glass filler. I just learned a simple trick from this a guy in YouTube. Um, you get a wax paper and do it like this when it's still wet and push in a little bit so you can have like forms already yeah. it's like here on this corner it's really really hard but I tried the trick and I think it's working So if the body filler is still a little bit soft, um, you take out the wax paper and wait uh, for about uh, 20 minutes to let the body filler um, harden. So that's it. Um, as you can see, I think I already got the lines. Yeah. So. Hopefully, this will turn out good. I think it's getting late, guys. Um, I'm done with the first and second step, which is preparation and filling. For me, the Bondo Fiberglass Repair Kit, it's, it's a good kit. But if the one you are uh, repairing doesn't have a good structure anymore, so you might get a uh, hard time um, forming the lines on 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 the fiberglass cloth but yeah you can still manage but for me I'm I think I might get the um, uh, self adhesive patch it's it's also from um, 3m bondo it's like a stainless mesh patch it's still a good cost it's i think it's just ten dollars so i might get that one and do it uh use it on the other side so that's it for now guys this is lucas trying to stay in a budget bye bye